morning guys, I hope you're all doing well. It's a very early morning, I had a little knock on the door at about it's 8 o'clock. It's not that early. It was early for me. Um, <laughs> so we're still at Shoreditch House, we're just going up for breakfast now. And I think we're going to go and sit by the pool, which would be really nice. Again, I will try and do some sneaky filming, um, but filming isn't actually allowed, so we'll see what I can manage. There's a really cute puppy outside. Oh, well, it's, it's not small. Yeah, it's, it's so just because we're really high up. <laughs> I'm not even sure it's a puppy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll well, see you later. just popped into um, our management's offices to do a little bit of work. I'm editing the vlog for tonight, cutting a bit close, but it should be up by five o'clock. And uh, we've just done a sneaky order of Nando's. I don't quite know how much food we have, but it looks like there's enough for four people here. This is actually my second Nando's in the last week, which is pretty bad. If anyone's interested, I always get the mushroom and halloumi wrap plain because I can't handle spicy food at all. So I'm gonna keep on editing my vlog now and uh, just enjoy my Nando's. Yum. Everybody. We had a little bit of a vlog fail yesterday. I got home and I literally fell asleep. I was so, so tired. I think it was a combination of sitting in the sun, not getting enough sleep last night and just generally being exhausted. So a nap definitely happened. Um, but today's an exciting one because I'm going to be announcing the winner of my giveaway. And um, so that's for all the benefit bits that I mentioned in last Saturday's vlog. Um, so I'm gonna do that right now. And then I also have the second giveaway to announce. Okay, so I put the tweet into this random retweet picker and we will see who the winner is. Very exciting. Is it gonna work? There we go. Emily Thompson, you have won. Congratulations. I will be getting those benefit bits to you as soon as possible. So, not much going on today. I did have a few things that I wanted to show you. So I was in London for the last couple of days and I managed to pick up something that I've wanted for so, so long, ever since I saw it was announced. First of all, I thought it was a rumor, then it was properly announced and I finally got my hands on it. It's the Lush Comforter Shower Gel. Now this is usually a bubble bar, the Lush Comforter bubble bar, which is the swirly pink and white one. I love those, I've been through probably a handful, more than 10 of them. They just smell so, so good and they've never done anything else in the comforter range and I saw this was coming out, obviously got very, very excited about it and went and picked up the biggest bottle I could find. So I'm very, very happy about this. I can't wait to use it. it smells just like the bubble bar. It's kind of citrusy, black curranty, and really, really sweet. It's just so nice. So I'm very pleased that I managed to get one of those. They do only have it in the Lush Oxford Street store though. So you do have to go all the way to London, unfortunately, to get it. And I don't think you can either order it online because it's from the Lush Kitchen. Hopefully though, you'll be able to in the future because I, I'm gonna need me more bottles of this. Okay, second thing is that I am also in this month's Elle magazine. It's the one with Ellie Goulding on. I really like this cover. And this is a similar feature to the one in Cosmo, which I'm also in this month. Let me see if I can find it. Here I am, I was really happy with this. I think it's a really lovely page. Um, but this is as well to do with the Nivea micellar water and the work that I did with Nivea. Um, so yeah, if you do pick up a copy of Elle magazine, let me know if you found me in there. I've been getting so many tweets from all of you guys and it's so lovely to see you all tweeting me that you've seen me. Um, and sending me pictures of your copy of the magazine. So thank you for that. Honestly, never thought I would see my face in a copy of Elle magazine. It's pretty amazing. So onto this week's giveaway and the rules are gonna be the same as last time. It's gonna be based on Twitter. I will leave a link below for the tweet that you need to retweet to enter. Very, very simple. It's gonna be open internationally so anybody can enter. And let me show you what I have today. Basically, the giveaway this week is for a massive bag of makeup. So let me just kind of empty this out. Okay, there is a lot of stuff here, but basically you have the chance to and all these bits there from Topshop and NYX and there's some really amazing products in here. There's the matte finish spray, the shine killer, pore filler, primers from NYX. There's this really cool palette, which I really want to try myself. Actually, this is the adorable palette. It looks like there's some 
really lovely neutrals in there. Um, and NYX liner, which I think they do some of the best liquid liners. They are really, really good. This is a bit of a cult one. This is the Jumbo Eye Pencil in milk or white or something. I've wanted to try this for ages, so you're getting one of those as well. A brow product, some more eyeliners, a matte bronzer and some blushes. The NYX blushes are supposed to be very similar to the MAC ones, so you've got those in there as well. And then the Topshop bits, we have Glow, which is one of my absolute favourites. I love this. It's so versatile. You can use it as a primer mixed in with products. You can use it as a highlighter. It's so nice. Um, there's a glitter here as well, which looks absolutely beautiful. Some lip products, um, a bronzer, a blusher, basically just anything you could want for a full face of makeup. So the winner of all that will be announced in next Saturday's vlog, so get retweeting for the chance to win all of those bits. So for the rest of the day, I have some videos to edit, or a video, the one that I filmed in Shoreditch House. Hopefully that will come out okay. I haven't actually looked at it yet, so fingers crossed. I'm gonna film Sunday's video, which is gonna be a non-beauty favourites, I think. And then tonight, Darren and I are going to see Jurassic Park 4, or is it called something different? Jurassic World, that's what it's called. Um, so I'm really excited about that. I haven't been to the cinema for months, I think. It's been a while, um, but I love Jurassic Park, so that should be really good. And obviously Chris Pratt is in it, which makes it 10 times better. So I am gonna get on with editing this video, filming and then I'm looking forward to going outside. So we're on our way to the cinema now. It's such a horrible rainy evening. It's not very nice. I don't particularly want to be outside. We need to go and get some petrol, park the car and find some snacks. Just made it in time. Just. That was cutting it close. It's ridiculous really. We had a heat wave yesterday in England. I managed to get sunburned and that never happens. Now it's rainy, gloomy, It's too hot, it's a bit hot as well. Yeah, it's not even cold. It's like it's really humid and just gross basically. Uh, it's just too much choice. Oh, I really want to be healthy. And I know I said I was trying to cut out sugar, but mm, so good. We just got back from the cinema. The film was so, so good. I love Jurassic Park, but it was, I think, probably my favourite of all of them, maybe apart from the first one. Um, Chris Pratt was just... Mm -hmm. On the way back, Darren stopped off and got me a subway. So um, I'm going to demolish this now. Thank you for watching this week's vlog. Not this week. Today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, we are going to eat our subways, um, watch a bit of TV and go to bed. So I will see you all soon. Next vlog will be on Tuesday. See you then. Bye.